Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here for the 11 a.m. Tiger Financial News Network market update. The Dow is down 300 at 35,670. Uh, this is going to be very interesting because it's had a spectacular move from the 34,000 level all the way to th almost 36,000. And now it's pulling back. It's just right, right now, it just looks like a little bit of a pullback. But we'll see. We've got the Fed meeting. We've got a lot of stuff going on this week. S&P. S&P is down 30 at 4682. Uh, made a lower high than on Friday. Um, still, after the big move it's had, you can expect a green, red, green, red. The sessions making higher highs, but it needs to hold 4678 to 4668 uh, in the next day or two. Otherwise, that's a problem. QQQ NDX 100. Uh, trading down 260, 395.40, just can't get out of its own way, just can't break above that resistance line. So the lagging, what we're seeing in the market now, especially with the IWM, is exactly what you're seeing in the stocks. You've got some leadership stocks that are, uh, some are making new highs. Some are actually turning down very sharply. You've got the IWM down 345. But wait a minute, we've got to look at gold. I'm, I'm looking at gold and I'm saying, okay, gold, are you going to tell us something over the next few days? It's at 1787, up two, but the nine period moving average is trying to rally a little bit. But look at the MACD trying to turn up. Stochastic is moving up slowly. So it means that if there is a push into the 1806 level, gold could suddenly be very attractive. Let's see what happens over the next few days. It's not doing it right now. If you're looking at the dollar, it's holding very nicely. Uh, it's up just a few ticks. It's also getting resistance. Uh, just uh, overhead, TLT. TLT's bonds. Bonds are up $1.94 at $150.80. So interest rates are obviously going to be a factor throughout the, the, the week. Uh, if the TLT, the Lehman 20 Treasury bond, closes above 153 in the next week, that's going to say rates are going down sharply. But if it suddenly pulls back and goes under 146, it's at 150 right now, that's going to be a big issue. Crude oil is holding quite nicely. Um, it's up five now. It had a little bit of a pullback. It's a 71, 71. So all in all, just a, 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 we should look also at the VIX index. I didn't do that in my show, the target the admissions hour a moment ago, sitting on the 200 period moving average. This is going to be a very important uh, week. Uh, close on Friday is going to tell us a lot. So stay tuned. You've got Larry Pesavento. You've got Think or Swim. You've got Steve Rhodes, Dave White, and Tom O'Brien coming up and check out my opening call, Dave News. Have a great day. See you tomorrow.